Hey, what's up YouTube? Thank you everyone for tuning in right now. I know I consistently say, hey, I'm putting out YouTube videos every week and I don't. Uh, so I apologize for that. Uh, but this video was actually meaning to make this video a couple weeks ago when I went to Chicago and talking about some street photography I did in Chicago with one lens. So I went to Chicago uh, for work. It was a quick trip uh, and I brought one lens with me, just the 51.8, the staple 51.8. Believe it or not, I always fly into O'Hare whenever I go to Chicago. This time I flew into Midway, uh, which I personally believe is a, a weaker you know, airport. So I wasn't necessarily downtown. I was actually in the Marriott near Soldier Field. So it was a nice, nice, nice hotel. It was just a walk to go downtown if I really, really wanted to get some good shots of the Sydney landscape. So um, believe it or not, I was fortunate to have time to go downtown and I said, you know, I'm a walk. And me thinking that it was going to be maybe a 20, 30, a 20 minute walk ended up being almost a 45 minute walk. And I got caught in the rain coming back. But um, I was able to capture some uh, pretty cool shots. If you Got some good film, some good footage uh, of the city, and with the 51.8 as well too. Now, uh, there's a trick with the EOS R and the 51.8 that I actually do. Uh, with the 51.8 on the Canon EOS R, you actually can get a little a 1.6 crop. I know a lot of people don't like cropping their photos with the 1.6 crop, but I don't care because it gives me some of the dynamic range that I want to actually shoot longer. So I, it was almost my 50 was almost like a. 85 or you know 85 when I was shooting so that made it kind of uh, cool to get actual di shots with a little bit more of a, a dominant range between the subject and the object I'm shooting so 51.5 now as I mentioned before Chicago is a deep city so that was a long walk but there was so much to capture there maybe at some point or next summer go back to Chicago and, and be able to capture some some footage there but I wanted, I wanted to make this video to talk about, you can capture a lot with one lens. And when you have one lens, it really forces you to be creative. Now, the 51.8, I wanted to pack light was the one I brought. I was able to capture you know, photos in Chicago as well as in the airport, videos as well too. Uh, but the 51.8 and just any lens that you work with, teach yourself how to be creative. Be creative with one lens. And once you get other lenses in your kit or other, other uh, you know, zoom lens or you know, a longer telephoto prime or a wide angle lens, you'll find out, you'll be able to see things that people haven't seen before or haven't got before because you were creative with that one specific lens. Now I know most of us have a bunch of lenses in our kits, um, but just go out and force yourself to use one lens one time. You know, just in a situation, if you're going out in the city, if you're going, going to shoot, it's actually gonna teach you how to be a better photographer, or a better videographer, no matter what you're doing because you're being creative with less. And when you have more, then you can be creative with, one, with more. So that's actually my Chicago blog. I wanted to make this short, sweet, simple, to the point. Um, maybe I'll make another video where I, I'm, I'm talking about maybe shooting in DC where it's a little bit longer. But for right now, that's all I have to say about Chicago. Um, if you're not subscribed, subscribe, please do hit that subscribe button uh, and your boys out.